all day today becca has been feeling terrible you know pretty much just as bad as she felt when she first found out she was pregnant but literally 10 times worse so she already knew today would be the day that she was going to give birth to the final cook baby and so she kind of already knew today would be the day that she would give birth um so as you can see darren is freaking out <laughs> um you would think that he wouldn't freak out as much because you know this is his third go around not really sure why he's freaking out but i guess everyone freaks out when you know something super exciting like this is happening yeah as you can see we set up for christmas um which is more than like a week away but this family has gotten really really excited about it the kids aren't even on winter break yet so that just shows you how far removed we are from winter fest on to the hospital we go also you guys oh she's having contractions probably but i also realized that today is cody's birthday as well so what better way to um celebrate his birthday <laughs> than to give him another sibling you know like a sibling that he never really wanted in the first place darren's just checking things out back there making sure everything's okay no complications we can't have that um we don't see the machine moving just quite yet wonder what's going on looks like things are frozen it's a girl oh my gosh that's why the game was frozen because this pop-up came up congratulations it's a girl Becca just gave birth to a baby girl I'm sorry I'm really excited I'm really really excited that's why I was clapping this baby needs a name what would you like to call her um the name I had picked out for our little baby is, oops, Charlie. I think it's such a cute, like gender neutral name. Becca, of course, is always into the gender neutral stuff, like I explained in the last episode. And of course, baby girl is gonna have the last name Cook. <gasps> oh my god i knew it was twins you guys i knew bro i knew she was having twins because something was off about that belly i'm telling you like that belly was huge but enough of that her name is cameron cameron cook obviously there is a bit of a you know trend with all the cook babies um twins becca and darren had twins oh my gosh i cannot believe this they had twins you guys they had twins who is this they had twins i literally said that i don't know how <laughs> this house could get any more chaotic than having twins and it literally happened i'm sorry if i'm not getting the best shots like my hands aren't even on the mouse anymore. They're on my forehead. I'm face palming myself because I definitely told myself this wasn't gonna happen and it did. So Cody is not gonna be happy. Not only are we giving him another sibling that he didn't want, we're giving him two siblings <laughs> and he didn't even want the first one. Oh, here they are. So let's move them. Oh, child, this is a Christmas miracle. Am I not allowed to say Christmas? This is a Winterfest miracle, y'all. I, I just, who is this? I don't even know who this is. We need to get to know our babies. Actually, it would probably help if they were in different colored bassinets. So one's gonna be yellow, one's gonna be pink. Um, so this is, uh, all right, so 
Shorty in the pink <laughs> is Charlie. And this over here is Cameron. Cameron is fussy. And we were supposed to go like see a movie and stuff with with Cody and I'm so sad that like that had to be put on hold because now it's dark outside and it's dark outside oh well at least Corey's having a good time but it's dark outside it's snowing it's just there's no um that's no condition to be outside watching a movie especially with it being freezing Oh, like his little face. We gotta catch this. It's aging up. Cody aged up. Okay. So he has level two motor skill, level two social, one mental, and two creativity. Um, just like I did with Corey, I'm going to do like a little randomized traits, close my eyes, do randomized three times, and we'll see what we get. Ready? One, two, three. Okay, cool. Self assured. Um,. I think he's gonna be a rambunctious scamp so we're gonna give him the motor skill I'm excited that Cody was able to age up because that means one less um, I guess you could say like dependent child in the household because now we have twins to take care of so um, it's a bittersweet moment so I'm gonna go in create a sim and you know fix up Cody's appearance a little bit All right, you guys, I am finished. Um, I think Cody, you know, it's definitely kind of hard to say already, like, what his personality would be. But, you know, this is just me projecting, you know, like, me um, predicting a little bit. But um, I think Cody is the definition of a rambunctious scamp um, he definitely enjoys being outside no matter the weather it could be raining it could be snowing it could be cold and freezing it could be extremely hot he loves just being outside running around um, and just getting his energy out I think you know if they had skateboarding in the sims if they had um, you know bike riding for kids in the sims he would definitely be outside doing one of those things hence why he always has a helmet on and um i think this helmet has just become a part of his everyday wardrobe as you can see um he just doesn't take the helmet off <laughs> and you know he just he loves his helmet he's the type of sim to just go around the house wearing the helmet and knocking on it and telling his sister Corey to to hit him in the head hit him as hard as she can to see like if he feels it and you know she'll whack him a couple times and he'll be like nope still didn't feel it <laughs> I was thinking you know why don't we just get this let's play on the road and go ahead and age up Cameron and Charlie so they could experience their first winter fest um you know 
all of the kids will be experiencing their first winter fest so why not so since everyone is here we might as well go ahead and have becca age them up hamron aged up um randomized traits ready <laughs> go one two three charmer okay <gasps> okay uh let's see one two three ideally i feel like she is easy going and um just really chill you know oh my gosh look at charlie and her curls okay we have to go to create a sim right now all right you guys for our purposes of you know the gameplay i decided that we would dress cameron in um like pinks and purples so you'll see that here and for charlie we just kind of give her all the other colors of the rainbow <laughs> um this is really cute i feel like charlie really loves rain boots um so she'll tell her mom every day she's like mama rain boots and so that's kind of how we're we will be able to um tell them apart we actually need to redo this room because this was cody's room but cody is gonna have to move in with corey and we'll have like a whole bunk bed situation and i'm really excited because i am not adding on any rooms to this house anymore all right you guys i have finally finished and there is a lot of stuff crammed into this room um so in my mind i would think that it took a lot of convincing for cody to come move into the room with Corey. Cody's parents kind of promised him that he got to pick his own um, bed sheets. So this is kind of what he chose. And of course we have um, a lot of Corey's things in here still as well. Um, you know, the activity table, her cute little arts and crafts. And this is their uh, animal that they play with, you know, scouts for Corey and these books um is obviously obviously <laughs> utilized for the both of them all right friends we are back and i'm pretty sure this is cameron yeah cameron i'm really scared <laughs> for darren because he has to stay at home with the twins and take care of them all by himself you know becca has gone to work and corey and cody have gone to school so it's just him and this little girl here <laughs> and this is charlie right here she's kind of sad don't know why uh let's see what's so wrong with you she's crying because her parent left <laughs> so it's i'm laughing because it's cute you know so i'm actually just going to uh sort of skip to Winterfest, and um i obviously will have screenshots and videos 